Okay, Thursday morning in the kingdom and I'm hurting. The dogs last night at 3 o'clock were barking. There was something in the bush behind the house. I don't know what it was. Maybe it was Bigfoot or something like that. And then we got a slight breeze this morning. So, so I have to stand over here by the wooden boxcar. That's the wooden boxcar right there. And the sun is so bright and warm. It's from the east over there, eh? Okay. Oh, my head hurts. Okay. Plus two Celsius this morning and feels like zero. That was at 7 a.m., but I think it's warmed up quite a bit, you know. Okay, on the yo-yo scale, that's 36 Fahrenheit. Ooh, is it warm. But feels like 32. Oh, there's a big jump in temperature difference. All right, let's scroll this way. Okay, look at that. There's the sun. The little trees are just blocking it, eh? Those toothpick trees. Oh, there's Dick. Let's scroll this way. Look at him go. Oh, I can't see nothing. But Dick is over there. I don't know if we can see him. I can't see nothing here. Oh, that's annoying. He's long lining, so he's carrying something in a basket. So he'll take it out to the drill, and then he'll bring back that gold. Yes, the gold in the drill core. Yeah, right. What a dream. Okay, I don't know. We got wind noise, everything. Oh, this is unreal. Oh, I know it's going to be a shitty day. But look at the flag exercise. He's having a good day over there. Look at him. Okay, look at him. He's having a good day. I should have waited. I should have had some drinks and then do this intro. Oh, today sucks. But I had the 41 out last night. Right there, pulling the drag. Because the road was too rough when I went to get the dogs... Uh, at the staff's house. It was terrible. I was almost spilled my beer. I mean, my coffee in the truck. Oh, in the book burp. Oh, I'm not doing too good today. Ah, now I got the burps. This intro is probably the worst intro I've ever done sober. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. All right, I better go. The boss is coming. Today's going to suck. Okay, here comes the staff ready to work this morning. We want to get a lot of things done here. All right, there she is. Look at her go. Okay, the staff's in a good mood like me. Didn't even wave. But she knew she was on camera. She's portraying herself as Teller from Penn and Teller, the magician show. So it dried up enough that we could get in here to this shed. And this is where we keep all the recycled steel. Yes. Oh, there. Look at that. So we, uh, it kind of has a water problem, just like most basements. So we had to wait for it to dry up in here so we could walk in here and put all the recyclable steels. This steel here, this pipe... We'll use it up quickly on the sleigh bunks and then we'll cut that booger ends off to use for scrap metal. Also too, this morning we got out the stump pan and the swivel bunks that are complete and we brought in the new steel or replacement steel to start the second set of swivel bunks and we even got the sheet metal over there. So it's all working out good. You have to plan ahead because when it's raining or snowing, we don't want to be out for trying to find this stuff. But also too, it's been well marked back in... Uh, 2020, I think it was, or 2019. So this is Lombard number three. That's the Lombard Slays. Okay. Okay, waiting two days in the kingdom here and the snow and the ice melted around the pallets or these totes here. So now we can go after this wall here and get it down and get organized. So I got the yard ready for when the staff arrives after lunch and then we'll be in full production again. All right, let's go have some lunch. Okay, got a little windy here, but look at how warm it is. I got bare arms. Wow. Fresh fresh meat for the mosquitoes. They're out today. Oh, and I got the burps. I had uh, peanut butter sandwiches for lunch. Okay, we got this all organized. Uh, tote number G here, whatever, that's full of uh, firewood now. But everything is cleaned off the roof. Now we're going to go after those. But the staff has arrived sober. She's over there on the quad. Okay, right there. And we're going to load up the welder, go down and get a front axle for the wood trailer. All right, keep you posted.
Okay, that ran rather well. We just used a skill saw with the wood cutting blade in it, or firewood cutting blade, and cut it all up and made it come apart. Now we can unbolt the timbers and lift them down. Okay, at Wilderness Alaska, it's best to use these totes for your recycled firewood and cut your plywood into stove lengths. That way you're only handling it once. So when it's a cold Alaskan winter, you're not having to go find the firewood in the snow. So bring a toad up to the cabin and then you can get your firewood. This is the way we've been doing it in the kingdom. All right, let's get back to work.
Well, we got a, quite a bit done today. Look at the pile of salvageable timber. Most likely firewood. We'll cut the rotten stuff off and put it in the totes for the wood stove. Just like in wilderness, Alaska. Okay, that turned out really well, getting that big beam out of there. I remember putting it there 12 years ago. It was a struggle, and then I welded it, but oh well. Well, my welds held just long enough so I could rip them in, out in a fit of rage, but it worked out pretty good. I'm not sure whose small, small bottle of Smirnoff is that. We usually buy the big bottles up here. Okay, this side of the tanks aren't quite dry, but I'm whipping out, th ripping out these willows. Because if you do it when it's wet, the willows come out, and then you get, uh, how would you say, a clean surface. So this is working out pretty good. Okay, I'll try and walk over here. So the mini squishing out the water, which is normal. This dirt or whatever hole retains water. So I got rid of all the rocks there. So now we can come in and get all those cat parts. When it dries up enough for the loader to come in without sinking. Oh well. Okay, we got lots done today, but we didn't get any dragging done with the 45, 41 Chevy. Oh, these lips need some vodka. Yeah, we're going to have some right away. And look at the flag exercise. The non-Alaskan flag. Look at them. All right, let's go walk the dogs, pick up the pony and rescue puppy, and then I drink some beer and make a video. This one will be a little short, so we'll add some short videos or not long videos from 2022. All right, talk to you later.